Sure, that's a good spin of it. Now, before we let you go, can what kind of advice can you offer to college students? Be it you know if they want to go into to entrepreneurship in some way, start their own business, or or publish their own book, what kind of advice can you pass on to them? Uh, this is an incredibly loaded question because we're looking at a marketplace that's kind of scary. So, yeah, yeah, uh, it's a tough right I, now. I think that uh, you know, again, from my from my career perspective, I've always worked for myself, with, with the exception of one chapter uh, where I helped build a company with a, a team. Mm -hmm. um, I think that people. Uh, I don't think they realize the opportunity cost of not doing what your calling is. Mm -hmm. um, uh, when, you, when, you, when you do something you're passionate about, uh, when you do something that uh, creates a lot of cultural value, the economics will come. And so my, uh, kind of my unsolicited advice is, is don't underrate your skills, your talents, and your, and, and, your, and your contributions. I think you should follow it because the most authentic things you can do are like rolling the ball down the hill. There's a lot of things that are pushing up there that just cost too much time and energy and money. It's a lot easier to do what your calling is.